Welcome to my work to be said Rana Ghat West Bengal India Let us observe this totally unedited fecal emulsification The patient is under topical anesthesia the cataract is soft nuclear sclerosis grade 2 and this is the ideal case for pre-op because if we try to hold the nuclear mass in such cases with vacuum the matter in front gets it enough we cannot hold the matter the such cases pre-op is the ideal technique by this time the main incision and the side port has been made the anti chamber has been filled up with visco and now this is capsulorexis with a ureter forceps size of this rexis is about 5.25 mm and now hydro dissection is done you must see that the fluid wave goes from one side to the other side yet We have seen that the fluid will go into the other side and on more hydro the nucleus rotates and now the antechamber is filled up with visco again and now see the pre-op the pre-op are in right hand the sustainer is in the left the nucleus sustainer hooks the opposite equator between the two instruments the nuclear mass is cut into pieces and in less than one minute we have got four pieces out of this nucleus this go again and now the fecal needle goes in the fecal needle goes in with its bevel down some superficial cortical lens matter is removed and now i rotate the nuclear nucleus for some time and now i start emulsifying the nuclear pieces one piece removed this is the second piece this is also removed emulsification is being done with 40% ultrasonic energy fluorite is uh, 47 and vacuum is 470 mm of mercury and all the nuclear pieces are emulsified in no time some more 2% spmc and in this case i am going to use coaxial irrigation aspiration device from otley the machine being used is otley faros and the microscope is oms 800 i have no financial interest in any of the equipments or lens mentioned in this surgery so this is the removal of cortex by coaxial irrigation aspiration it is done but there are some lens fibers sticking to the posterior capsule now let us see hydro polish hydro polish means the irrigating probe of bimanual ia goes in and the irrigating jet of fluid is swept over the posterior capsule enlarging the main wound by 0.2 mm the wound which was 2.8 is now 3 mm and now here goes a hydrophobic acrylic single piece monofocal aspheric intraocular lens this is technis on from johnson and johnson a beautiful lens i love this lens again no financial interest i like this lens and let me mention this and moxi and now i close this side port by hydrating corneal stroma see if the wound is not stressed we don't have to inject a lot of bss into the corneal stroma little bit is okay and now this is the final lavage of the anterior chamber the space between posterior capsule and the lens is irrigated and aspirated the anterior chamber is irrigated and aspirated and 
the lens is nicely positioned at the center and then the antechamber is formed the simco comes at the wound and it is done the patient is under topical anesthesia and we have completed the case in about 5.2 minutes thank you very much for your attention hope this video will help you in developing your surgical skills be a great surgeon and serve your patients with love respect empathy and great surgical competence